Welcome to the Brand Doctor Podcast, strategies that help entrepreneurs build reputable and profitable brands. Here's your host, Henry Kaminsky, Jr. Hey, what's going on, everyone? Henry Kaminsky here from UniqueDesigns.net with another episode of the Brand Doctor Podcast. And this one's super exciting, guys. So all week, we've been talking about brand inclusion and brand culture and how that forms a very attractive business to your audience. And today's Daily Gem, guys, I want to focus in on what brands you're recommending to your friends and colleagues and coworkers and family, if be, and why it's so important to pay attention to why it is that you're recommending these brands. So why is the competition getting all the referrals and you're not? That's the question I want to ask yourself today. Because a lot of the entrepreneurs that come through my doors are frustrated and struggling tremendously with obscurity. They have a great brand, they have a great business, they love what they do, they're passionate, but nobody knows who the hell they are. And that's the problem at hand. And this sucks because I've been there, you know, a few years back. You know, it was so hard for me to get over that hump of positioning myself as an expert in branding and design and, and, and my, my, my field. Because if there was a lack of confidence, there was a lack of knowledge, all of those things started to play on me until I finally figured out how to break through all of that. So let's dive deep today. So here's the question. Why, what brands are you recommending right now? And specifically, I want to ask you, why are you recommending those brands? Okay? Put yourself in their shoes real quick. What makes them outstanding that you want other people to know that you buy from them and you want them to buy from them as well? Is it the way they make you feel? Is it the quality of service? Is it the level of competence? Is it the authenticity that they showcase? Is it their persistence? Do they push you out of your comfort zone and help you become that better person? I've seen this over and over in the past decade I've been doing this. These awesome entrepreneurs have fantastic products and services, but they're getting the cold shoulder from their audience because they don't have the juice that makes themselves referable. So here's today's prescription, guys, from the brand doctor. I want you to write down the last three brands you recommended to somebody. And more importantly, I want you to ask yourself why you recommended them. Then I want you to think about the last three referrals that you got from your clients. And most importantly, why did they recommend you? So don't worry. If you're not getting referred right now or you're not getting recommended by other folks, we're going to fix that tomorrow. So don't sweat it. Stay tuned to another episode of the Brand Doctor Podcast, and we'll get this wrapped up. We'll get this taken care of. We have solutions. But today's Daily Gem is all about brand recommendation. What and why? So it's horrible to think that your competition, that who is clearly not as good as you, is getting all the work and you're not. Now, I finally have overcome this with some help from my mentors and my uh, business coaches. And now I've become highly recommended by my peers and a lot of these different Facebook groups now because I'm doing the right things. I know what works and I know what needs to be done to move the needle when it comes to building attractive brands. So I'll leave you with that, guys. Have an awesome, awesome day. And I will catch you on the next Brand Doctor podcast episode. Talk soon, guys. 
You've been listening to the Brand Doctor Podcast with Henry Kaminsky, Jr. To get your appointment with the doctor, visit Brand Audit at www.uniquedesigns.net.